Hey guys, welcome back. And tonight's tea is about Tory Lanez being charged in Meg the Stallion's shooting. And everybody knows she was shot a couple months back. So go ahead and smash that subscribe button and stay tuned for the video. Hey guys, it's your girl Tiffany back with Millennial Tea. Go ahead and smash that subscribe button. Take a seat, grab you a cup because you know I'm serving it hot. So diving straight into the video, as you all may recall, this is the video where the where um, Tory Lanez and Meg Thee Stallion, along with her friend, was pulled over um, after the shooting. Um, on that day, Tory was charged with um, having a concealed weapon. But recently today, he has been um, charged in connection with the shooting involving Megan Thee Stallion just weeks after the singer released an album claiming his innocence. The L.A. County DA's office hit him with one count of assault with a semi-automatic firearm and one count of carrying a loaded, unregistered firearm in a vehicle. The DA also alleged Tory inflicted great bodily in injury if convicted the rapper singer faces up to 22 years and eight months in prison as we reported the prosecutors have said they were mulling over a charge of felony assault with a firearm against tori after megan said she was shot back in july remember tori had only been arrested but only charged with possession of a firearm Prosecutors are now explicitly pointing the finger at Tory as the man who pulled the trigger, leaving Meg with a gruesome foot injury. As TMZ reported, sources connected to Tory say that there were mitigating circumstances, and based on what we know, we believe Tory's going to say it was an accidental shooting. Megan didn't help the DA's effort with the social media caption, which has since been deleted, that said she had her back to the suv when she was shot in the heel that might indicate she didn't see with her own eyes when tori allegedly pulled the trigger well here is a look at her foot and as you can see it's pretty messed up they said she had to go into surgery um and you can see on the video she was hopping and you know blood was coming out of her but um a lot of people owe her an apology they basically kept poking at her poking her out of her for the story and you know find out what who shot her or whatever and she had to come out like yeah um you know tori is the one who shot me or whatever and of course his people had already been denying it to the point where it's making her look like a liar and people was questioning her character like what why would you lie and say something like that about him but he knew what had happened whether it was an accident or not like you know I guess you don't want to, you know, incriminate yourself, but people owe Meg the Stallion an apology. So go ahead. And if you were one of the ones that were talking smack about her, go ahead and drop her that apology um, because apparently he did shoot her. And it, I mean, it, the little foot picture shows that, you know, her foot was injured, um, whether it was a direct sh um, shot or not, but nobody deserves to be shot. And hopefully Tori, you know, hopefully that was an accident. I, I don't know. They said it was a heated argument. But that's ridiculous. You're out here, you know, with this automatic weapon. Obviously, you don't know how to work it if it was an accident in the back of the car. But um, we'll see what happens with this story. And if they go through with the charges, um, they don't seem like they're beefing. Besides him trying to lie and make her seem like she made the whole story up and he didn't um, shoot her. But um Go ahead, smash that subscribe button, drop a comment on what you think happened, and peace out.